So popping into IKEA, as you do, not looking for furniture, going to the Swedish food market, the bit at the front near the checkouts where you get the hot dogs and stuff, but there's a bit to the side where you get the Swedish treats, so you can get frozen meatballs and stuff. They bought to us not one, not two, but three different flavours of sweetie. And I can see if I can actually get them all in camera and hold them up so you can actually see them all. So, without further ado, I am going to brutalise this pronunciation. So this is Lordag, Lordag Scoddies. Was it Lord? Lordag Scoddies. I don't know. Tell me downstairs in the description. Downstairs? Yeah, down below. Is the sweet peak of the week. And, as you can see in the top right hand corner, before I get onto the flavours, is these are gelatin free. So, if you have to be gelatin free, these are going to sort you out no end. So what do we have here? We have, starting with, so sweet jellies with gooseberry, apple or pear flavour. I guess they are all together, and if you want to see, this is what's in them. And they're produced in Finland. So that's nice. This one. We have this one. Which is sour jellies this time. Instead of sweet. With rhubarb, lemon or lime flavour. And without less to do. We have sweet jellies again. Raspberry, cambri cranberry or forest fruit flavours. These all sound very good. And I forgot to show you what was in the other ones. But I'm sure they're all pretty much the same thing. But just so you can see. Yep. It's in. Good. Excellent. So we should start with... This one. So inside of this little baggie, this already split open bit, and I'm going to open it up. If I can open it. Yep, I have to rip the corner off. Ugh. Nope, this isn't working. Done. So in here, there are little, like, almost. I would say heart shaped, but they're more like just sort of random disc shapes. These look like berries. And there are three flavors. There are three distinct colors in here. I think. Or is it just my eyes? But yeah. Yep, I think they're distinct. Distinct. Maybe. Uh, let's just give them a try and see what happens. So we have what may be. Put them back in there. Gooseberry apple or pear flavour. They don't smell of much of anything, just in case you need to know, just so you're sure. Hmm. Definitely pear. Definitely pear and something else was not apple. Hmm. So they've got a nice soft texture. They're not like um, some of the um, gelatin, gelatin alternative sweets can be a little bit hard, but these are far from hard. These have got very nice subtle flavours. Hmm. One down. Put you back there. Next will be... Hmm. 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 I'm just gonna, yeah, go with this one. Let's open it up. So we've got these open. Yep, so these have more distinct colour differences between the three flavours. They're kind of like, yeah, they're kind of blobby fruity things, so... But yeah, as I said, they're quite soft, which is good. Watch me. 
I think. Hmm. Very very fruity. Hmm. Hmm. Once again, very subtle flavours. Not super overpowered, which is nice. And brilliant texture. They're nice and soft. And without further ado, not really the main event, the last bag, we have sour. So unlike the other ones, these have a coating on them. Like the first bag, it's going to be hard to tell the flavours apart, possibly. Possibly. Because whenever I think up, yep, got three. Three. Hmm. So, bottoms up. Hmm. Straight off, definitely sour. Hmm. Very nice citrus flavours. I think doing all the ones I've somewhat overpowered the rhubarb. Mmm. But very nice. Very nice indeed. I'm assuming this is a rhubarb. Very nice. There, top class, high end, awesome sweeties. Not much else I can say about that. So if you pop yourself down to IKEA and you happen to see them, yeah, give them a try. These are very nice. Something you could definitely sneak into the cinema and nibble on, or just nibble on at home, whichever. But yeah. Very nice group of chewy sweets. No need to be so cautious about the gelatin free because sometimes they can be a bit weird. But very good. Highly recommend. Highly recommend.